Hi, welcome. It's Sunday. Thought I'd do some more tinkering on the smart home. Now I'm still working with Home Assistant at the moment. It's the very early days. I've unboxed, I've plugged on, started it up. Today, the tinkering begins. Uh, now, where is Home Assistant Blue? Well, stuck it in the corner. It needs to live over there with the old router that's in need of a good update and there's an old NAS that I'll even use today. But let's get started. And I thought I'll do a couple of, kind of housekeeping tasks today. So the first one, set up some access to files so I can actually get to the files on blue. So to do that, I'm going to use the Samba add-on. Sounds like a dance. Uh, I'll go over to Supervisor, Add-on Store, Samba. Okay, let's install that. I can kind of, well, there's some documentation. Need to set up the config file. Okay. Uh, Let's just wait till that installs. There it is. Now config file. Don't use this password. It's just for demonstration purposes only. I will change this later. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> and let's shorten the username. I'll go with that. Everything else looks good. Let's save and let's start the add-on. Go and have a look at the log. What's happening? Okay, should be ready. And waiting for connections. Now in Windows 10, let's go and have a look on the network. Let's go see what I find. There's Home Assistant. Need some credentials. Put in the amazing password. Remember them for now. And we're in. So, there we go. Nothing in the add ons, nothing in share. But if we dig into config, yep, then we start to see all the files no blueprints well not yet anyway great first thing done now while i'm into the files thought that popped to my mind was well i should probably back up this system you know when the tinkering starts to get heavy i need to be able to roll back in case i break something so backups would be handy now i did first think i'll just copy some files off here but then i found this great little add-on, thanks to Thomas Maurer. Thanks, Tom. This looks good. Samba Backup. So this is a little add-on that will create a backup and store it on my old NAS. So first I need to do a little setup on the NAS. Let's go and do that. Now this is the old laziness it's kind of old still works for now so the way this one works is i just create a user account and then i'll create a share so i'll just add the user let's create again one with an amazing password and add that now let's jump back to Home Assistant. Now in the add-on store, I'm not gonna find this one. I need to add another repository. So let's take that GitHub, hit the dots, add repository. Done. Now we can go back here and take a look and we type in, there it is, Tom's Home Assistant add-ons and there's the backup. 
So now we install that one. Uh, let's connect in. Access denied, but not now. We're in. Let's have a look. What did he create? Backups and HA backups. I reckon that's a pretty good naming convention. I'm gonna do the same. So let's create in here a new folder. That's gonna be backups. Then inside backups. Where did it go? Did I just delete it? I did. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now inside backups. We'll create another new folder. HA backups. Great. There it is. So, we should end up with some files in there. Let's go over to the config. Let's see if we have the IP address correct. Let's restart. There we go. Ah, okay. Now, this is where I need to go with old school compatibility mode. Now we wait and see what happens. Let's go and jump into here. Come on, come on. It's that moment where you just keep hitting the refresh button. Come on, go, go. Let's check the logs. It's running. Refresh. I told it to trigger it. 12 past midnight. Just need to be patient. Let's go and check it out. There it is. Beautiful. This is good. This is fun. The tinkering will continue next week. Now I'll have every day a backup of the system and I can go and tinker in the back end and look at the files that Home Assistant is dealing with and creating. Next time, I'll start setting up some devices. More Home Assistant on the way next week. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.